The Bland Lemon. So how did I come up with a cocktail called The Bland Lemon? Well, that was actually pretty easy because there's already an existing cocktail called the Blind Lemon Jefferson, which is named after a blues guitarist and singer from the 1920s, I think, out of Johnson City, Texas. No, Johnson City, Tennessee, sorry. Why is Tennessee important? Well, because Mr. Bradley Denton prefers Gentleman Jack whiskey, which is a Tennessee whiskey. So there's a Tennessee connection there. So we're gonna go ahead and do that. And uh, what we use for this cocktail is, uh, since I don't actually stock any Gentleman Jack, I, I honestly, I don't have any Tennessee whiskey. I'm sorry, it's, it's horrible. But what we are going to use is a bourbon, and we're going to use a Berkshire bourbon. This is a smoke and peat bourbon, and we're going to use that because, well, Mr. Denton is just smoking on the guitar. So there you go. There's, there's where that comes in. Um, the, cock the, blind Jefferson, the Blind Lemon Jefferson cocktail has lemon juice in it and has honey syrup in it and then some bitters. Uh, they use orange bitters. It's actually based on an old recipe called the Gold Rush. We're going to swap that out for the, uh, the citrus component. We're still going to reside with lemon, but instead of using honey syrup, we're going to use a sweetened uh, yuzu puree, which is going to be kind of a, an interesting citrus component to it, as well as a sweet component. And then we're going to back that up with a Japanese-style bitters, the iki bitters that I have from um, Embitterment uh, Bitters. So that's what we're going to do. We're going to put this all together in a cocktail shaker. We're going to shake it up and we will have the bland lemon. All right, so we start with our shaker. We need three quarters of an ounce of yuzu syrup. So I need a cocktail jigger, one cocktail jigger. It's appropriate. I'm using a Japanese style cocktail jigger. How's that? All right, come on. Excuse me a second. trials of putting your syrup in the fridge. All right, there we go. All right, three quarters of an ounce. You're gonna come out this time, right? Yes, there we go. So I need three quarters of an ounce of the yuzu syrup. Do Oh, it's so thick. This is gonna add such a heavy mouth feel to this cocktail, it'll be very nice. Okay, so there's three quarters of an ounce of the yuzu syrup, which is essentially a sugar syrup with yuzu pu puree in it. I bought mine from Monin, uh, so you can get it online if you want. It's really actually quite tasty stuff. Three quarters of an ounce lemon juice. This is freshly squeezed lemon juice just a few minutes ago. Please don't use concentrate, it's nasty. So there's three quarters of an ounce of lemon juice. And then we need two ounces of bourbon. Like I said, we're gonna use the Berkshire smoke and peat bourbon, two full ounces of that. Oh, I'm getting kind of low, I'm gonna have to visit my mom up in New York and get me some more of this. So there's two ounces of that. And then we're going to add some bitters to this. Now bitters are nothing more than botanical agents and bittering agents thrown into a high test uh, alcohol. And they just add a depth to the cocktail. So we're gonna go two dashes of these icky bitters. So there's one, and there's two. Those will pair really, really nicely with the yuzu. Next, we're gonna throw some ice in here and shake this up. Fill that, scoop this back in, seal this, and get ready to Nice and cold. Canister's real cold. It's what we want. And then we are going to double strain this because the yuzu has some pulp in it and I don't actually want that in the cocktail. So I'm gonna grab me a strainer and then I'm going to grab me a second strainer. Ta-da, tea strainer to the rescue. And here we go. Deep citrusy yellow color to this. Just like that. 
played around with different uh, attempts to garnish this. Turns out, I don't think it actually needs a garnish. I think it's quite tasty as is. So there we go. The bland lemon. Oh, it's tart. It's got that biting tartness from both the yuzu and the lemon. And yet the smoke still comes through from the bourbon. Yeah, that's a, that's a fine blues riff right there. So there you go, the bland lemon.